then I'm into my Twitter account. And it is going to send you an email confirmation that you're going to want to confirm. Now notice on the side it's going to start suggesting people to you. Totally, you should follow Bill Selleck, at Bill Selleck. And then the onion, that doesn't sound like something for education, so goodbye. And I don't know who some of these other people, like Mathalicious might be good, so I'll follow that person. How can I tell if it's somebody that I want to follow? Like, do I want to follow Instagram? No, I don't want to follow Instagram. But I do want to follow Shawnee. How do I know that? So I can click on, see where it says Shawnee, his name, and I click on it. And I can see about him, he's an unrepentant tech Ed tech evangelist, he's a teacher, he's in Oregon, so that sounds like someone I want to follow. So I'm going to go ahead and click follow. You may also, while you're in there, look and see who are they following. Forget their followers. Anyone can follow you. So who does Shawnee think is important to follow? So let's go ahead and click on who he's following. You can scroll down. He's apparently following S'more. He's following Professor Daly, who is an assistant professor of education. Well, that sounds like somebody I might want to follow. So I'm going to click on his name and click follow. And now I am following Professor Daly. And I go down, I'm looking for, you know, this guy's a superintendent. I don't know, maybe that, see how important the bio is? Maybe I want to follow this guy. So I go ahead and click follow. So these are all things that you can do to, to find followers. Now along the top, you'll notice you have the home button. It's going to take you back to your Twitter feed. And then there is the connect button. And the connect button is where you're going to find where people mention you. Now, I just made this account, so probably nobody is mentioning me. Oh, how sad and lonely am I. Although I'm noticing on the side here, it's suggesting that I follow at Matt underscore Aguayo. Good choice. I'm going to follow him. Okay. And so then you can, up here at the top, you can search. So I'm going to search for pound CI149. So this is a hashtag. The hashtag is a topic. So I'm going to look up the topic of CI149, and I can see people who are tweeting about CI149. So these are probably good people to follow. You don't want to follow your fellow CI149ers. So we're going to follow these guys. Um, but the other thing you should notice is that it comes up with, when you search for hashtag, it goes with top. Well, these are the top tweets for CI149, but I actually want to look at all the tweets for CI149. So I'm going to click on all. Hey, there I am tweeting about from Ramsey Musalam, who is ridiculously awesome. So what I can do is, if you'll notice in this tweet, I have the hashtag is blue, but then also anyone I mention at is blue. So if I just click on that at mention, it's going to take me to the super awesome Ramsey Musalam um, website, or rather his Twitter profile, and then I can follow him. And he is a very selective follower. He's only following 669 people. So let's see who he's following that we could follow. So I click on following. Katie Reagan is a good person to follow. Tiffany... K-E-D-C Tech Consult. And just lots of good people in here that you can follow. Karen Menzing, Ms. Menzing, a YouTube star teacher, Google certified teacher, passionate teacher. Yep, I want to follow her. Follow. All right. So then I'm going to just go ahead and come back up here to the